Hemophilia A. What is it? Hemophilia is a mutation on a gene located on the X chromosome, which makes it a sex-linked disorder. What causes the infamous bleeding of hemophilia is the missing of factor VIII protein, which controls the clotting in your body. As you can see on the chart over here is an X-linked recessive gene, which makes it highly more likely for males to have it than females because males only have one X chromosome. What does hemophilia do? Well, hemophilia causes blood clotting problems. As you can see in this image over here, this is a normal person. A normal person gets cut, they bleed, and then their blood starts to clot and form scabs. Well, with someone with hemophilia, that does not happen. They continuously bleed. Hemophilia also causes deep internal bleeding, which can in turn result in muscle swelling and joint pain. People with hemophilia must be careful on what activities they perform, otherwise they could result in serious injury. What is the probability my child will have hemophilia? Well, that depends on the parents, if they are a carrier, or if they have the disease, or if they have nothing. Males are more likely to have this disease because males only have one X chromosome, while females have two. With a dad who has the disease, there are only two outcomes. All daughters will be a carrier, and none of the sons will have it. With a female who has the disease, there are four outcomes of a child. One, a girl who is not a carrier. Two, a girl who is a carrier. Three, a man with it. Four, a man without it. What type of treatment is there for this disease? The treatment for this disease is very simple. In severe cases, victims need to have plasma transfusions with factor VIII protein. With mild cases, regular doctor visits are needed to keep this person healthy. If a victim with a mild hemophilia gets a cut, it is treated normally as a normal person would have it. What are the symptoms of hemophilia? The symptoms are non-stop bleeding from cuts, swelling, as you can see in this child's knee, or bruises. Also, painful joints are another telltale sign that a person has hemophilia. In mild cases of hemophilia, people have 5% to 50% normal clotting and might not show signs of bleeding until adulthood. Most cases aren't diagnosed until injury occurred. What is the life expectancy of someone who has hemophilia? Well, people with mild cases can live rather normal lives with rather normal life expectancies. People with more severe cases may only have 10 years shorter on their life than the average person. So, people with hemophilia can live rather normal lives and enjoy themselves. That was a quick overview on hemophilia. Thanks for listening. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me at www.hemophiliadoc.com. Remember, hemophilia is not a life-threatening disease, and it can be treated for humans to live an enjoyable life.